So let's get her freaking set up here to freaking cut them. We'll freaking cut them. Freak yeah. So a good suggestion I want to give you today is get yourself one of these uh, freaking soapstone uh, uh, marking deweys because you'll mark on any kind of surface you know and you can cut and whatever you want there you know and you just advance her up more and it wears out quick but you can get the refill kits there and it has like six or eight of them in the, ju in the jug right so yeah we're going to chop that piece out of there that's going to be our new welded on spring perch guy and uh, freaking here we go. See if you first tubes remember your glasses. Here we friggin' go. Hopefully. Uh, oh. Forgot the main ingredient. That'll help. That'll make her speedier. Try that again. Yeah, she chopped through that. Friggin' no problem at all. That's an awesome tool. I love that thing. So this is pretty awesome. You know, that little thermometer thingy. So the uh, friggin' table is 72 degrees, 71. Look where I was cutting. Ooh, mama. 310, 12. <laughs> How hot's this hunk of steel here? 220. Wow. Where does she start to cool off? Wow, oh, eh? So, 300 degrees. Dare me to stick my tongue on that? Not friggin' likely. Oh, freak yeah, now we're welding the freaking things together. It's gonna be awesome. Got my, my freaking new uh, helmet on, yeah. Speed, Captain. More speed. Yeah, 
check out them factory welds, eh? For freak's sakes, I love this thing. Oh, I freaking love this welder. That'd be the best freaking piece of machinery ever. That thing there. 180 millimeter. That's all you need. Unless you're working on a tank. So let's see how hot this is. I bet you it'll just freaking go, eh, eh, not doing it. Hi. <laughs> We got the rock here. The rocks? Uh, not too bad. 200 and. So it's spiking to four something. This is plant. I just one. Not bad. Yeah, that one just goes high. That means I'm too high to register. And there we go. Look how hot that is. Number two is glue. Oh. Boy, couldn't get her much redder than that, eh? Holy freak. I'm gonna have to let them cool off for a wee bit, I guess. Love that helmet, too. That's freaking great. So, yeah, she's pretty uh, freaking dusty looking in here now, so I think I'm gonna go outside and see what's going on. Probably not much. No, just about where I left her. So, I just gotta rearrange my three hairs up here. That's not too bad. But anyways, uh, I guess we'll let that uh, air out there for a while and let those things cool and uh, I'll maybe just uh, probably should get us all mounted up here before I weld these things on and then just get them in position and then I can adjust the freaking uh, do him hickey there for levelness, right? But I um, might interfere with those other perches. I don't know, I might have to chop them off. I haven't got that far yet, but uh, yeah, I'll uh, maybe end the video here today, guys, and uh, we'll get working on this again when the room's cleared out there and uh, freaking Dewey's are cooled off and I can get them somewhat lined up where I want them on this thing and uh, we'll be looking pretty freaking awesome and then we can start putting her back together. So yeah, for old U-bolts, eh? Garbage, scrap, but well, that's all right. I'll get money from Freaking rates we will. So yeah, we'll try not to drown here. Ugh. She's still building. Frig, eh? But uh, pouring in pretty darn quick there too, isn't it? You can see her now. Almost need to dig a little trench there or something, put a little thingy in. I'm pretty much lined up right there to do it, so frig, but not now. I got our problems at the back. Remember the flood way back? Yeah, well, you should see it now. Maybe I'll take the camera back and show you that out quickly, but I gotta dig a little hole back there, hopefully. She works and then sucks some of the water out of there because it's pretty friggin' bad, so... But, uh, let's, uh, maybe head back there for a minute. Gotta unhook this guy. Gonna need, uh, to get some jacks under it somewhere. I guess, uh, yeah, we'll figure that out. So I had something freaking awesome happen today, too, you guys. Uh, I wanted to mention... Doors down. What I wanted to mention to you is, uh, I had a freaking visitor. I can't believe it. From watching the YouTube videos on, you know, Bill's T-Mac stuff. And uh, he's a truck driver, his name was Mark, and uh, he didn't tell me his YouTube username or I'd tell you that, but uh, he doesn't have a whole lot of videos up right now, he said, so, um, but uh, yeah, that's freaking awesome, that's like the first, uh, first person I guess I've had come visit me, just out of nowhere, you know, he was driving by, drives a truck apparently, he's driving by, he thought, hey, that's the place, I'm going to stop in. So Friggy stopped in, um, stopped at the house I guess first, and uh, I was down at the garage here doing some crap, and uh, the uh, my wife calls me and she says, uh, where are you? I'm like, down at the garage, why? Oh, there's somebody here in an orange vest looking for you. I'm like, oh crap, what'd I do now? What'd I do? Uh, and I'm thinking, I didn't do anything, so I should be alright. <laughs> should be alright. So yeah, so he walks down to the garage and uh, says, oh Frig, I've been watching you on YouTube and stuff. I'm like, oh friggin' cool. You know, like Pug gets all kinds of visitors there all the time, you know, but I guess he's maybe got used to it, but Frig, that's the first actual person I've had come visit me. So that's pretty friggin' awesome. So uh, yeah, anybody else want to come in the area around Orangeville here, you know, uh, just freaking look up the cemetery here in Orangeville and friggin' come on out, have a visit. Uh, we'll do some, do some, you know, working on crap, whatever, if you want, or just want to talk, or do some tubing at the same time. We'll get you on a video or something. That'd be friggin' awesome. So, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, we got her unhooked, got her on jacks. 
I'm gonna fire it up here again. Yeah. And uh, we'll get on her and then uh, head to the back. Well, there she is, just streaming down here like crazy. And it's all downhill from here. You know, makes a big puddle and stuff. And I'll show you at the bottom here. She's getting pretty bad too. She's getting pretty bad. Wow, this has come up a lot even in the last hour. Too, for doing awesome. I had her dug down to about where that freaking ring is, so that's pretty freaking decent. But uh, apparently the UPS guy is up at the house. I got to run up and give him some freaking money, and uh, I think we got more Jeep parts coming. Freak right! Oh, freak yeah! Look what the UPS man brought me. Quattro Tech from the states. Cost me fortune, but uh, she's here. So uh, let's uh, let's get busting her open and see what we got now. Goodness. We got her new Jeep tubes. She's here. Friggin' rights we did. Oh, well, let's see what's actually in here. Well, we got a bunch of paper. That's all right. And a little wee tiny box. Wow, really? You needed to send all that just for, oh, wow, just for the magazine? For oh, really, I don't need a magazine, but. What do we get in here, tubes? What the frick did we get? Freaking carburetor kit, and I ain't gonna lose this one for freak sakes. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be awesome. I was not sure if it's coming in there too well, but uh, man, we got little balls and clip dewies, and oh my goodness, this is gonna be a nightmare. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we're uh, freaking uh, good to rebuild that carb, I guess, so that won't be for a wee while. But uh, what I'm going to do right now. Is put this thing back in this box. And these are all watching this when I ask you, where did I put that freaking kit? You're gonna tell me, because I'm gonna probably ask you, where did I put that freaking kit? Okay, we got her closed up. We're walking over to my toolbox and we're putting it right there. Carburetor kits on the toolbox. Remember that, okay? Because I'll forget. So yeah, it looks like the hole's going to be draining back there, so I'll let that sit for a day or so, see how it's looking, and uh, if we have to drill her some more, we'll drill her some more. So uh, I guess I'm going to actually end the video here now, just all of a sudden more cool stuff comes up I want to show you. So uh, yeah, so you guys have a good friggin' day, and we'll friggin' talk to you next friggin' video.